Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Today we have a 2006 Cadillac XLR V model, which is the supercharged version of the XLR. This is presented in light pewter uh, with ebony interior. We'll start at the, the rear here. We got the trunk open and this is just a unique trunk, how the way it operates and opens. It's just a work of art. Uh, as you can see here, we have the Cadillac symbol that was added on. This is nice and clean. You can see how high the trunk goes here. Uh, the whole lid comes up. We have the hard top in the, uh, in the trunk right now because it's down. Uh, so you don't have a lot of space when the top is down. You have all this space here. Uh, but once the top is up, you can utilize the whole compartment here. In the trunk here, we have uh, the uh, trim panel for the for the dash with the wood on it and the, the aluminum finish and we have the uh, uh, factory nav system here with the cd player uh, the previous owner took it out uh, and replaced it with a newer modern model that has bluetooth uh, but this will come with the car and it as far as we know it, it does work so um, to me i would we, all, we also have a compartment down here you can put some stuff uh, but if it was me, I would probably put that stock unit in because I think it looks so much better. Uh, we have the power trunk close here. So I'll hit that button here and you can see just come down, how quick it comes down there. Wonderful. So coming up here, you can see that beautiful paint color. We have uh, roll bars here that looks like it's, it looks like a leather uh, around the roll bar there. I'm not sure if it is or not, but it looks like it. We have the really nice uh, Cadillac uh, third brake light here and the Cadillac um, lights there. Uh, we have the nice panel in here, kind of a unique material. Uh, and here's your, your V model. So that letter means a lot because it makes it supercharged. And then there's your XLR. Uh, coming back here, you can see the sensors on the bumper. So it does have reverse sensors, uh, pretty advanced for that time. And then we have the active exhaust. So the exhaust can change the notes. Uh, the exhaust note from loud to quiet, much like uh, today's modern Corvettes. If you look at the wheels here, we have unique Cadillac 19 inch uh, uh, spoked silver aluminum wheels. Uh, we have uh, for tires, we have Continental tires. Uh, tire size is 255 40 R19s in the rear. Uh, we got black. Uh, black brake calipers and you can see it's got the cross drilled uh, uh, rotors um, and that's borrowed off the, the Corvettes of its time as well let's check out the front here so you get the, the front just as nice a little bit of a smaller tire in the front we got a 235 45 R19 uh, you can see the the black brake caliper there and larger brake rotors okay coming to the uh, door panel we have the ebony let interior so you can see we have a uh, kind of a two-tone niche uh, we got the leather um, and the the suede uh, and as well as nice wood accents and some uh, aluminum accents as well uh, so we got the power door locks up here we got a vent in in the door and the, the vent comes through here pretty unique uh, power windows we get the Bose performance sound system and we also have an extra compartment down here. That's kind of cool. And the electronic door release. Let's take a look at the dash. The dash is very nice condition. We got the nice stitching on the dash as well. A nice V badge here. Open the glove box here. We got the owner's manual in here. And we'll go across here, take a look at the uh, door jams. They're nice and clean. We got the V badge there. It's pretty good, nice and clean. We got special carpeted floor mats with the V Cadillac symbol there. We have uh, power seats, so you got power, um, power, power seats with power bolster and power lumbar. And then let's take a look at these seats. So again, that two-tone leather with suede. A very high back seat, as you can see here. The seat looks like it's in pretty decent condition. We have speakers built in the seats. That's pretty cool there too. Uh, over here we have uh, the sensors, so that's your sensors for your backup sensors. So that tells that'll light up uh, when you get real close. So all three will come on when you're too close. Here we got an extra compartment here, just 
twist this and open this up so you got some extra storage compartments here kind of neat okay let's close this door show you the profile back here really cool looking trunk lid there kind of sharp and uh, smooth at all the same time um, and this will i'll show you the the hard top when it goes up uh, but just a work of art and the paint just wonderful in this car it's nice and shiny love the color here's your black seats look great and on the door down here it says supercharged and the v model there very cool coming around here we got a cadillac looking front bumper we got the fog lights in there and look at these headlights they are ahead of its time um, they are adaptive uh, headlights so they they will turn as you steer the wheel very cool and i like how it says xlr up here coming across here we got a uh, unique uh, xlr grill so it's like a chrome mesh grill underneath and as well as the, the the front grill here with the cadillac symbol very cool we also have washer fluid for your headlights i believe that is so very cool and let's take a look at the engine bay itself so the hood's open you can see the cadillac symbol on the hood liner there uh, and here's the engine so it's a 4.4 liter north star v8 with 32 valves uh, with a roots type type supercharger so this one produces 443 horsepower that's a big number for its time back in 2006 and it still is today we also have a nice uh, cold air intake that was added uh, we have some stainless covers that were added as well kind of give it an extra look and then they put these uh, blue uh, lines around the, all the lines there and we got some braided lines here and there as well very nice and tidy engine compartment very quiet motor so produces quite a bit of power but it's not a overly loud bearing motor and then we come here you can see the paint is just wonderful uh, the xlr ha also has that hood bulge in the center which the regular xlrs don't it's a very subtle car yet it's just an amazing car it's built in the the corvette um, factory in bowling green so you can see a lot of corvette traits in it it's on the corvette chassis so very cool we come in here the door panel so again that black suede here with the black around with the wood accents uh, coming up here we got the power locks here's your another vent here in the door we got power mirrors power windows electronic door release and again that same compartment on this side both stereo here let's take a look at the dash it's got a heads up display just like corvettes uh here's your uh door jams nice and clean your nice and b plate here a little bit of corrosion here but not too not too bad and nice and clean throughout there let's hop in the car now um okay over here we have your sorry about that your uh dimming lights for your dash your heads up display here um down here we got your fuel door release and your trunk re uh, release so that's power operated here's all your headlight controls here uh, on the steering wheel we have uh, uh looks like voice command and we got uh stereo controls on both sides here and we got push button start so let's let's fire that up same button as a corvette we got memory seats as well uh, i forgot to show you that uh, but we do have memory seating for the driver and the power seats power bolsters uh, coming out here you can see the wheel it's a nice round leather wheel here feels great it's nice and soft smooth and let's, let's just zoom into the dash here so on this car we have 83,310 kilometers and you can see that speedometer goes all the way up to 260. Um, around this you can see it says uh, Bulvaria uh, they designed these gauges um, special for Cadillac so that's pretty cool they also designed the key feature the key fob says the same thing on there so really cool uh, up here we have the uh, universal garage door opener and we have a light sensitive mirror here here we have the, your vents with your hazards in here and then we have your all your dash commands here here's your uh, 
aftermarket Pioneer head unit. Um, the reason why this, the owner replaced it because he wanted Bluetooth, so this has Bluetooth. Um, but again, the factory um, will come with the radio will come with it as well. Um, and it also replaces this, this plastic look and will give you that nice wooden uh, material back when you put that one back in. Okay, down here we have uh, dual zone climate control. We got heated and ventilated seats um, for both driver and passenger. So that's very cool back then. We have automatic transmission. It's a six speed automatic transmission. Um, we got the nice wood grain here. In this one here, we have the cup holders and your cigarette lighter. Uh, here's your traction control button. Here's your power convertible top, hard top. And then we have a nice leather wrapped console cover here. We'll open that so you can see how deep it is. Uh, we have a 12 volt socket here, a USB and auxiliary here. Very cool car. So again, this car makes 443 horsepower. So lots of power behind this car. Very cool look. They only made these cars from 2006 to 2009 and less than 2,200 units um, for the whole, all those years. So very uh, low production car. Uh, we also have active exhaust. So uh, there's also a switch on here down here right now it's open I'm gonna rev it up for you guys so right now it's the exhaust is open you can hear it sounds great I'm gonna try to find it down here uh, it's got it hidden well okay I just closed it now you can hear it's quiet definitely a difference there all right let's open it back up so when we go back out there we can hear it there we go I'm gonna flick on the headlights here I want to see what it looks like and let's put the convertible top up so let's just hold this button here and uh, just watch the magic so so much is happening here this uh trunk lid is moving now the whole thing that piece is moving in now sorry now we got the hard top coming up see all the mechanisms there there's the window folding back in back down the trunk's gonna come back down and that's complete let's put the windows back up here let's move up to the front of the car now so you can see the hard top looks great up or down there's your headlights nice bright headlights they still look modern even though it's a 2006 a great looking car got a great sound to it not too obnoxious there's that hard top again i was talking about again the paint is wonderful on this car and very shiny let's take a look at these led tail lights look how bright they are and then there's the active exhaust that rumble just a wonderful car so this is a 2006 Cadillac XLRV supercharged model. Uh, produces 443 horsepower and is paired by a six-speed automatic transmission. This is in light pewter with a uh, black interior. This is here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come, come on down and have a look at this one for yourself. We look forward to seeing you real soon.